people ask, where do you get your ideas? Well, right here. All of this is my Martian landscape. Somewhere in this room is an African veldt. Just beyond, perhaps, is a small Illinois town where I grew up. And I'm surrounded on every side by my magician's toy shop. I'll never starve here. I just look around, find what I need, and begin. I'm Ray Bradbury, and this is... Well then, right now, what shall it be? Out of all this, what do I choose to make the story? I never know where the next one will take me. And the trip, exactly one half exhilaration, exactly one half terror. I am Matilda Hanks. This is my castle. I have waited amongst my clocks and pictures for many years. I'll not give in. Oh, no. One day he'll come. But this is my castle. I've all my ammunition here. Oh, he'll come, but he's no chance. I'll not give in, oh, no. Delivering. I didn't order anything. So you're not bringing something here. Did you hear what I said? If you want to talk to me, well, you can talk. But in the meantime, you don't mind if I pour myself tea? There. I'd have offered you some if you'd been more polite. But you come in here. High and mighty, with never a buy or leave. You think you own the place. There. You've made me lose count. Now, start again. Tell me the things you've got to tell me. I'll pay attention. But no smut. And stop staring at me with that funny look in your eyes. Good Lord, it gives me the heebie-jeebies. <laughs> now, about that wicker basket and those four men. You don't need them to carry that. Why, it's light as thistles. Where have I seen a wicker like that before? Oh, yes. It was when Mrs. Dwyer passed away next door. 
So that's what you're up to. Right. You just sit there till my Emily comes home. She'll take care of you, young man. She'll shoo you out so soon, you. Let me tell you about Emily, my fair, sweet child. I remember the day her mother died, 20 years ago, leaving Emily to me. Ever heard of people dying for good reason? That's why I get so angry with you and your wicker. You hey, wait, Hilde. What's going to do with your life? Papa. Why don't you settle down? Mary. Raise a family. I like laughing and singing and playing. I'm not the marrying kind. And I can't find a man with my philosophy, Papa. What philosophy is that? That death is ridiculous. But, Papa, just once I did find a man with my philosophy. Oh, my darling, just once. But what can we do? Fight. Kick it below the belt. Don't believe in it. Oh, and that man, he liked laughing and singing. And I'm starting my own philosophy here and now. White silly, the people only live a couple of years and then get shoved like wet seeds in a hole but nothing sprouts. What good do they do? Lie there a million years, helping no one. Most of them fine, nice, decent people. Or at least trying to be. But more than you, my dearest Papa, and more than dearest Mama, I lost my darling. But you weren't listening, Papa. You just faded away like a photograph left out in the sun. I couldn't stay after he was cold. It would have denied my philosophy. I lost my darling. He stole him. He took him. That sneak thief stole him away. He did it. He did, he did. I never got married. I was afraid of living with a man 20 or 30 years and then having him up and die on me. It would have shaken my convictions like a house of cards. I shunned the world. I screamed if people so much as mentioned death. How do you know all those things? <laughs> you think you can talk me into that silly wicker basket? You're off your trolley. You lay hands on me and I'll... Don't simper like a sick dog. I'm too old to be made love to. That's all twisted dry like an old tube of paint and left behind in the years. Young man, you are refused because I am all of a piece I add up. I've been fighting you all my life. I won't give in now. This is my castle, my fortress, all my ammunition is here. I've been getting ready for you for years. You haven't a chance. Are you just going to sit there, young man? Or don't you move from that chair. Don't you come creeping around me. I'm just going to close my eyes for a moment. Yeah. Yeah. You aren't getting up out of that chair, are you? Better not. I'll keep one eye open for you. Yes, indeed I will. Indeed I will. 
Every. So deep. Down. Underwater almost. 